So what was it like to come into this well-known franchise and work with Bruce Willis? Uh, it was pretty daunting, I guess, um, but incredibly exciting. And, uh, you know, most of my nerves had subsided by the point I was, you know, cast in the, in the project. And, um, yeah, I just looked forward to it. It was, it was going to be a massive undertaking. Uh, it was a really ambitious script. And, uh, you know, I knew there was going to be a ton of action and some great scene work. And I just, I just got really excited about it. And, uh, you know, it was everything I dreamed of and more. And, um... Like Father, Like Son, The Apple Doesn't far, Fall far From the Tree. Those are um, some words that could describe uh, the father-son dynamic. Yeah. Uh, but there are major differences in the way that your characters approach things. Can you discuss that? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, I mean, you're right. They are, they are very similar people in a lot of ways. And I think that's where some of the conflict and tension kind of uh, arises because... Um, you know, they, they kind of get into these arguments and whatever and they're being just as stubborn as bullheaded as each other and uh, hence they can't kind of figure it out. But, um, yeah, the differences that lie there, I mean, Jack's a real strategist. He's, he's a planner and uh, it probably started as something that he was rebelling against his father's ways of, of kind of going about things and winging it and seeing what happens. And uh, it's interesting to see those two kind of styles, uh, you know, meld together and, and uh, you know, see them having to work together to... To not only um, bust out of there and stay alive, but also patch up their relationship. And I think that happens in the process. It, it adds an interesting element. And uh, what can audiences expect this time around with uh, Good Day to Die Hard? Well, I think they won't be disappointed. Um, you know, this film offers everything the, the, the past Die Hard films have. It walks that, that great, you know, fine line with the, um, the wisecracking humour and the epic action sequences and, uh, you know, these colourful villains against this kind of dramatic backdrop. Um, you know, this is the first one that takes John McClane uh, abroad and uh, it's all set in Moscow and getting up to no good over there. And, uh, you know, it's just, it's, it's, it's funny, it's, uh, it's witty, there's a sentimental element, but it's, it's just jam-packed with uh, carnage and chaos. So this movie opens on Valentine's Day. Uh, you think it's the perfect date movie? I think it is the perfect date movie. I don't. I can't think. I don't know what else is out there that weekend, but I think uh, this is a perfect movie for you girls to assert yourself, get out there, tell your old man where you're going to go, and you're going to go see a movie. 